Hello there guys, welcome to episode 4 of our Real Madrid gameplay. We start this off with a game at Villarreal. These are doing quite well in the league at the moment. They are currently sitting in 5th after 7 games. They have not been beaten yet. Only them and Atletico Bilbao are the two teams that have not been beaten in La Liga. So this is going to be interesting today. Uh, we're going to play the same team because we did really well away at Ajax. Um, so hopefully we can see some more of that today. Um, but it's going to take a lot. I think to beat these, obviously they they look hard to beat. Oh god, and there you go. That's the look that they needed. That's it now, that's a game changer. I'm gonna to have to take Raul off. See that that is a killer. That's a game killer right there. And there's absolutely nothing we can do now. Because the game is gone. Oh, has it though? Maxime's come out of nowhere. Honestly, he almost, he almost got sent off then as well. What is happening? That would have been two keepers sent off. We just seem... I don't even know if it's our fault. Like just like... Two penalties. Look at that. Two bloody penalties. And then we go to Nantes away in four days' time. Come on, there you go, there's a goal. Hierro, wonderful. Yikes. Okay, I'm going to put Guti on here. We will put Guti, who's injured here, where's Figo? There he is, Figo. Okay, I'm a little bit concerned here because I think they're going to sneak a goal at the end. I don't have to bring someone else on. I might, oh, I don't know. Oh, that's annoying, man. Get in. Right, I'm going to bring Morientes on for Maxime. I know he's on a hat-trick. I'll take it. They got very lucky there. I think if we had... 11 men for that entirety of that game. I think it would be a different game altogether. I really do. Figo's out for 10 days. Great. Right. Okay. Let's just seal Champions League, uh, our Champions League place up here. So that means that there'll be nothing resting on the Lazio game then. Uh, that'll be quite nice not to worry about it. It'll give us a bit of breathing space as well. We play on the 3rd and then Lazio is on the 6th. So actually we could just create our focus on that game on the 3rd in La Liga and not worry about the Lazio game if we get a result here. So I think that's what we've got to spam for two matches. Bloody hell. Dismissed our appeal. Okay, right, let's get this done. Central midfielder Figo is, is gone. Let's put Jeremy in there for now. Let's see. I quite like Jeremy. Raul's tired. Oh, no, he's definitely tired. We'll take him off. We'll put Camp on there for now. Right, come on. Let's just finish this. There we go. Straight away. Let's have no messing at all here. I want this done and dusted so we could just move on. Okay, 2-0. Oh, 2-1. That's annoying. I'm telling you, Maxime is getting us out of some scrapes at the minute. He really is. He's turned into a wonderful striker for us. It just shows what happens when you have quality players around this guy. But yeah, that, that's pretty much it, isn't it? We're pretty much through here. Good thing is we've got two home games in the league as well, which is good. That means that we can really try and push on and hopefully get six points from those games. Oh, this isn't good. Helgera doesn't seem to be playing that well, does he, at the minute? That's the second time I've looked at him, he's playing at a five. There we go. Roberto Carlos, get in. And that's it, we're qualified. Okay, wonderful. So we don't need to worry about that now. Pinheiro is injured. Um, just realised that we have four goalkeepers, which we just actually don't need in the first team. So sorry, nine million. Hey, he's a good player. 
got Edmundo. Alex is a really good player. I actually try and go for Alex, but again, it's another foreign player which would which would actually drive me out. Rincon. Oh, no, no, he's not the one I'm thinking of. Oh, he played for Real Madrid, though. 96. Didn't know that. Just one suitable player. Determination, tackling. No, we might have to wait till the end of the season before we send these guys out. Okay, Rayo. Now we need to win this because of the last game that we had. Who's that? Who's tired there? Morientes. Just in the nick of time, don't you worry. Campo, McManaman's back, that's good. Maxim's 92, Solari's... Solari can be changed, though, that's the good thing. Oh, bloody hell. Oh, it's Jeremy, isn't it? That's what I'm... Yeah. Yeah, get McManaman in there. That's going to have to work. Come on. I want to win. Oh, who's... Th He's head-butted him. Solari, you're coming back on, mate. I cannot believe that he's done that. If this costs us three points for a home game, I'm going to be really pissed off. I cannot believe he's been sent off for headbutting someone. Oh, bloody hell. This is going to cost us here. Oh, thank God. Thank God he's there. Get another one. Finish it. Oh, I'm panicking now. I really am panicking here. Oh, thank God for that. Right. Sub, 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 sub. Maxime, you beauty. Duty on for McManaman. Job done. Wonderful. Okay, that that was good. I'm going to appeal it, but I mean he's probably going to get a massive a massive fine anyway. Right, guys, I'm going to leave that there. That wasn't too bad at all, apart from the Villarreal game, which was a bit of a letdown because the game was ruined after the red card anyway. Um, it's not too bad. So now we've got Sociedad next, Espanyol away, and we've got that Lazio game, which nothing is riding on now apart from top spot. Um, I suppose you want to you want to finish top, don't you? But yeah, I might give a few other players a chance in that game. Anyway, guys, please remember to hit that like button, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys later.